The MT4 platform has the ability to give sound and email or text alerts based on price levels or at a specified time. Expert advisors or custom indicators may also be programmed to make sound and email or text alerts. If you have not already set up your platform to send email and text alerts, please watch the video titled How to Set Up the Email and Text Function in MT4 before proceeding with the rest of this video. To set up alerts in the trading platform, first go to the terminal window, then to the Alerts tab. In the blank area above the Alerts tab, right click. In the menu, select Create. The Alert Editor window will open. Select the Enable box. Select an action, sound or mail. Select the pair that the alert is for. Then the condition. Bid less than, bid greater than, ask less than, ask greater than, or time. And enter the price value or the time, which is based on your computer's time in 24-hour notation. The Maximum Iterations setting determines how many times you would like the alert to sound or the number of messages to be sent. The timeout is the amount of time between iterations, between sounds or between messages being sent. For example, if you have selected 1,000 iterations with a timeout of 10 seconds and your alert triggers, you will receive 1,000 emails, one every 10 seconds. So be careful when selecting your iterations. Because a buy trade opens at an ask price and closes at a bid price for a take profit level on a buy trade, usually you will want to use the bid greater than option and consider setting the value one point below your actual take profit level. For the stop loss level on a buy trade, you will usually want to use the bid less than option and consider setting the value one point above the stop loss level. Next, because a sell trade opens at a bid price and closes at an ask price, for a take profit level on a sell trade, usually you will want to use the ask less than option and consider setting the value one point above your actual take profit level. For the stop loss level on a sell trade, you will usually want to use the ask greater than option and consider setting the value one point below the stop loss level. Now, if you want sound alerts, select the sound option in the action field. You may select from several audio files that come with the trading platform to make different sounding alerts. You may assign one sound to mean one thing and another sound to mean something else. To select a different sound, just click on the button with the ellipsis at the right side of the source field, and a window with a selection of audio files will open. Left click on the file in the list you want, then select Open. If you would like to hear the sound before setting the alert, press the test button. Be sure your speakers are on and the volume is turned up so you can hear it. If you want an email or a text alert, select the mail option in the action field. Now the source field becomes the subject line of an email. If you need more room for additional text, click on the button with the ellipsis at the right side of the source field and an email message window will open, providing you with additional space for your message. After you have completed writing your message, click on the send button. This will not actually send anything, it's just how you close the window to get back to the other settings. If all the other settings are as you would like them to be, select OK. In the Alerts portion of the terminal window, you will now see your pending alert. When an alert is pending, the text will look normal, and the counter will be at zero. When an alert activates, the text becomes bold, and the counter begins to increase with each message sent or alert sounded, up to the amount you set as your maximum iterations, which is shown here as the limit. You will hear a sound from your speakers if you have set sound alerts, or you will begin to receive email or text messages depending on how you set up the alert. More information about the alert function can be found by going to Help, then to Help Topics. Select the Search tab. Type in the word Alert, and select List Topics. In the list provided, select the option titled Terminal-Alerts. The information will open to the right. You are now ready to begin using alerts.